Health Prevention Emergency Response Team has been constituted by the President to handle the crisis, which has been reporting to the President on a daily basis. The Public Health Emergency Management structures at all levels, national, regional, districts, have been activated and placed on high alert. National Technical Coordinating Committee meetings are ongoing. The Emergency Operations Center, EOC, has been activated and have met five times. Alerts have been sent to all regions to activate public health emergency management committees to initiate preparedness activities and enhance surveillance for respiratory diseases. Stakeholder engagements have been conducted with the Ghana Health Service, Ghana Health Service Directors, Headquarters, Regional Directorates, CEOs of teaching hospitals, the Christian Health Association of Ghana, private sector, the National Ambulance Service, the Noguchi Memorial Institute for Medical Research, the Kumasi Center for Collaborative Research, Kutuka International Airport, the World Health Organization, and several other donor partners. The Ministry has also engaged the Chinese Ambassador to Ghana to enhance information sharing and discuss monitoring through surveillance activities on returning Chinese nationals to Ghana. The National Technical Coordinating Committee has met twice to plan coordination and preparedness activities. Monitoring of the national preparedness is being done through the WHO Preparedness Checklist. The National Public Health Emergency Preparedness Plan has been updated and the COVID-19 Preparedness Plan has been developed. The Director General of Ghana Health Service has held a meeting with all the regional directors of health services to discuss preparedness activities and planning for the outbreak. The regional public health emergency management committees have been activated and all the regions have actually updated their plans. Parliamentarians and select committee on health have been briefed on preparedness activities on two occasions.